on this channel. I'll be talking about whatever I fucking want. Today, I'm going to talk about Bill Belichick. Bill Belichick is the longest running coach of the New England Patriots. He has been the coach for over the past 23 years now. And apparently, some fans on Twitter want Bill Belichick fired because they got fired Bill trending over the last two or three days ago. And I just gotta say, clearly, people who say fire Bill on Twitter are not thinking strategically here. Like, you cannot just demand that the Patriots should fire their long, outstanding head coach of the 21st century in the middle of this season or towards the end of this season. You can't just do that. That is unethical. The people who claim that the Patriots should fire Bill, trade Mac, and hire new GM because they hit rock bottom is not the solution that the Patriots need. What the Patriots need is a new strategy, one that can put the Patriots back on the map to where they were 23 years ago. Bill Belichick is still the greatest coach in NFL history, and I truly think that Bill wants to win another Super Bowl. I truly think that. I know he still has it in his heart. I know he still has that passion for it. He's not stopping anytime soon. Maybe someone should take the Patriots GM role that Bill Belichick surprisingly has for, for about three years now. But firing Bill Belichick is not a strategic move at all. I do think that the Patriots need to make some corrections here. First and foremost, they have to at least stop benching Mac Jones because we do need a quarterback to win the games. And we can't have a quarterback to win the games if he's just going to be benched every game. That's the only issue that I have with Phil Belichick at the moment. But other than that, he's still a good coach. Even if some NFL fans think that we still cheated, and we never did, Bill Belichick is still the coach that once was. As much as I would like to have something to change, it's not going to happen because you're not going to just fire Bill Belichick immediately and move on all together. You can't just strip Belichick all of his duties. Fans like this should be grateful that Bill Belichick is here for a reason. We shouldn't have to unleash Cunningham just to get rid of all of the dead weight on this team. It's not going to work like that. And if you think that someone at the Patriots has to fire Bill Belichick because you have seen enough and that you don't want anyone to ever be calling Bill Belichick the greatest coach of all time, then you're just ignorant. The fact that you're impatient and you're using, and you're using war, war words to demand that the Patriots should fire Bill Belichick is completely disingenuous. You have to wait until the end of the season. That's how it works. Robert Kraft isn't going to fire Bill Belichick immediately following the game. That's the stupidest idea. Ever. Firing Bill Belichick tomorrow doesn't do justice. He earned his right to stay. And he can evaluate talent. Bill Belichick is not the reason we're in this mess. And we don't need to hire Dion and draft Shelder. Everyone should be grateful that we got carried too many Super Bowls. But 
Bill Belichick is not the most overrated coach ever. And Bill Belichick is most certainly not washed. And you have every right to tweet by Belichick all you want. But to answer y'all stupid ass question, they will not. They will not cut Mac Jones and send him to the sun. All because this is Bill Belichick's best pick. If you think that he wouldn't stick around to see the game pass him by, then you're completely delusional. Because he is staying. And he's going to improve no matter what. And so what if he's about Tom Brady? I still believe in Bill Belichick. No matter who is quarterback. But we don't need to keep changing quarterbacks. We need to keep the one we have and help him gain his abilities. And that's what Bill Belichick would do. And just because that some of you are happy that Fire Bill is trending will only make us lose more games if we had a new coach right now. So I, as a Patriots fan, don't want to see the outcome of us losing if we had a coach in the middle of this season. And if you guys are not going to wait, then you shouldn't watch football then because all you're going to do is bitch and whine online all day about the Patriots losing because you are blaming Mac Jones and Bill Belichick. Instead of uplifting the team, cheering them, get a grip, be grateful, grow up. So give Bill Belichick more time. He doesn't have to retire yet. He's not up for that. At least right now, no one should be fired, traded, and sent to retirement. That's not a strategy that I fully support. All I care about right now is the Patriots' long-term goal, which is to go to the Super Bowl and win. That's it. So Bill Belichick is going to do just that. Focus on the present, not the past. Just because you think that Bill Belichick is nothing about Tom Brady and that you think Robert Kraft needs to fucking grow hair and fire him and you don't even want to be wasting your time watching the games anymore this season because you want Bill Belichick fired and Mac Jones released before tomorrow morning? That is certainly not going to happen. At least this person has the right idea. He says that he will not change his mind on this. Bill Belichick can coach as long as he wants to be the coach of the New England Patriots. I will never agree with those who won fired. Amen to that. Look, I understand people's frustration with the last two games, but that doesn't mean that Bill Belichick should be fired in the middle of the Patriots season. You have to be grateful for what you have, and you have to stop spoiling yourselves. Stop begging for a win. That's not who we are. We don't act like children who pout and cry all day asking for candy after being told no multiple times. We are adults, and we have to act like one. We can't just lash out on Twitter begging for the Patriots to fire it. Bill Belichick. We have to be better in that. We have to show compassion. We have to show encouragement, not negativity. We have to show our gratitude instead of booing our own team for no reason. Booing our own team doesn't help. Instead of blaming Bill Belichick and Mac Jones, look at yourself in the mirror first and see what you done wrong that you can do to fix. Just give them time. The Patriots only lost two games. 
it's not the end of the world. The Patriots still have all season long to change that. And they will. All you need is patience and gratitude. So don't lash out at Bill Belichick. Have faith in Bill Belichick. Because at the end of the day, we still need him as a head coach of the New England Patriots. Thank you.